Hey guys, Solanum here from playearn.net. If you're on the lookout for the newest games powered by the blockchain right now, then you just click the right video. For today, I'll be talking about not just five, but six of the newest play to earn games listed on our website. So without further ado, let's get to the list. The first game on our list is Ardoxus. Ardoxus is a strategy card game being built on the Binance Smart Chain. Ardoxus is a strategic crypto game that claims to blend fun and safe earning through a sustainable economy. In this game, you can collect cards, defend towers, and battle alongside friends in a nostalgic, community-focused adventure. The game features a variety of heroes with different classes that you can control. They have specific attributes, and you can level them up to make them stronger and make the best team. Some of the heroes are Lumia the Sorceress, Fritz the Mercenary, and Tamra the Archer. The game has multiple modes you can choose from, and you can play either by yourself or in a multiplayer environment. War mode in PvP lets you battle for NFT heroes against others through strategic gameplay. Mining mode is designed for investors with limited time, focusing on maximizing revenue with minimal effort. In this mode, the rarer your assets, the higher your potential earnings per minute. PV Tower Defense Mode lets players use skill and strategy to earn rewards. And there is also a PV Multiplayer Adventure Mode where you can take full control of your character and explore vast landscapes. Like I mentioned earlier, Ardoxus claims to have a sustainable and fair economy that is built on secure in-game purchases, fair competition, and affordable cost, all underpinned by a strategy to enhance token value by burning tokens. If you want to learn more about Ardoxus, you can check their website. The next game on our list is Forgotten Playland. Forgotten Playland is an action party game being built on Beam. Forgotten Playland is an upcoming, free-to-play social party game. It is set in an isolated and abandoned attic where a group of small plush toy characters known as plushies have been left to their own devices. A key feature of Forgotten Playland is the social hub. This is a dynamic and interactive online space where players come to hang out and socialize within the game. It's located in the attic and the starting point of every player's adventure. The area buzzes with activity, providing a lively gathering spot for players. Within the social hub, there are also thematic areas that serve as distinct districts, each dedicated to a specific theme or mood. There is the space disco area, the jungle camp area, and the beach bar area where you can choose to stay. The game has a station that features deep customization options, allowing players to express their individuality and creativity. Players can customize up to six different traits of their plushies, skin, head, eyes, neck, arms, and legs. And there is the minigames chest, where players control their plushies through a series of imaginative and competitive minigames set within the creatively repurposed confines of the attic. Each minigame showcases the plushie's competitive spirit. The games range from lighthearted fun to subtly sinister challenges. Some of the games are bump -a ball and Jumble Rumble. The game is slated for release in Q1 2024. For even more info, you can check their website. The next game on our list is EtherQuest. EtherQuest is a collectible RPG being built on the blockchain. EtherQuest is a game that lets users capture, collect, and conquer 3D Ethermon. You can train them, level them up, and engage in epic tactical PvP battles. As you strategize and build your ultimate Ethermon army, you can make your way into the battle arenas and compete for the ultimate quest prize pools. There are over 150 unique Ethermon to collect and more than 250 unlockable rewards for you to get. If you are a fan of monster collecting games like Pokemon, then this game might be right up your alley. While not much more info is out yet, they do showcase some of the Ethermon you can collect. A few examples are Oaken, Luminix, and Gustroar. By the looks of it, it does seem like they will have elemental types as well, similar to how types work in Pokemon. The game is currently in its closed alpha stage, and they are launching their quest token soon on March 7th. If you want to learn more about EtherQuest, you can check their website and socials. Liking this list so far? Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel, so you're always updated with the newest play to earn games. And now, let's get straight back to the list. The next game on our list is Cart Party. Cart Party is an action racing game being built on the blockchain. Cart Party is a racing themed modular party game set in the metaverse, powered by Unreal Engine. It also claims to be the first modular party game in the metaverse. The revolutionary module system claims to endow the game with countless hours of gameplay, where the only eternal theme is competition, the only target is honor, and the only limit is imagination. The game is set in the Dark Tower world, a place that has been reshaped by natural disasters and projected other parallel worlds, creating diverse landscapes and terrains. There are two modes mentioned right now, the first one being Jumper Carnival, and the second is Turbo Arena. The game has a component system as its core feature. 
This enables players to equip different components on their carts to perform various actions such as jumping, battling, diving, and kicking the ball. Cart upgrades provide extra advantage in competitions. Upgrades come in different forms and bring different effects. It's up to you how to build your fleet. The game also has a seasonal leaderboard system, which rewards the top ranked players and guilds with rich rewards and honor. This also recycles the components at the end of every season. The game is currently in their testing phase. For even more info, you can check their website and socials. The next game on our list is Eternal Crypt. Eternal Crypt is a dungeon adventure game being built on Polygon. Eternal Crypt is a blockchain game based on the classic RPE series Wizardry, where players can explore dungeons, collect treasures, and use alchemy to refine blood crystals. The game combines both clicker and strategy elements and has a lot of features to offer. The player can collect and customize up to 36 adventurers that come in the form of NFTs. Each adventurer has their own race, class, and ability. The adventurers can explore the dungeon, fight monsters, and obtain treasures and blood crystals. Blood crystals are a precious resource that can be refined by adventurers with the alchemy skill. The refined blood crystals can be used to upgrade the adventurer's equipment, skills, and legacy items. Legacy items are special artifacts that can be inherited by other adventurers. The player can send their adventurers to the Pit of Dadal, a mysterious labyrinth that changes every time. The deeper the adventurers go, the more rewards they can get, but also the more dangers they face. The player can return to town at any time to claim their rewards and heal their adventurers. Treasure chests are randomly found in the dungeon and can contain valuable items or traps. The player has to be careful when opening them, as they make trigger penalties or lose their adventurers. Adventurers' ashes are the remains of fallen adventurers that can be revived by finding their lost souls. The revived adventurers can join the player's guild as new companions. The game is scheduled for a release in the first quarter of 2024. For even more info, you can check their website and socials. The last game on our list is Stray Shot. Stray Shot is an action shooter game being built on the blockchain. Stray Shot is a third-person shooter game where you step into the boots of a bounty hunter, ready to take on rivals in intense matches. In this game, you'll discover a world of unique characters and a variety of game modes. You'll have to compete by accumulating points and proving your skills to qualify for exclusive prizes and high-stakes weekly and monthly challenges. You can choose to go solo or team up with friends to claim top-tier loot and exclusive rewards. The game has three modes, Deathmatch, Extraction Shooter, and Last One Standing. In Deathmatch, you fight other players in a free-for-all battle and try to kill as many other players as possible before the timer runs out. In Extraction, you team up with other players to extract a wanted target from a heavily guarded enemy base. And in Last One Standing, you have to outlast all other players in an elimination tournament. As you play, you can also collect different hunters and weapons. Bounty hunters will be equipped with one weapon initially, and additional weapons can be discovered throughout the map. You can collect them all to grow your arsenal. Everything you earn in the game is yours thanks to blockchain technology. You can keep, sell, trade, or use them to upgrade your gear. It's all up to you. The game is currently in beta. For even more info, you can check their website. And that's a wrap for today's list of games. If you were looking for the newest blockchain games right now, then I hope this video helped. And for more info on everything about blockchain games, check out our website at playtoearn.net where we have the largest database of games that have all the info you need. That's it for today. See you next video.